The last thing that we're going to do with this worksheet is predict if our molecules are soluble in water using the rules for predicting solubility that I went over in the lecture for section 11.6. So sol uh, molecules that are soluble in water are going to be ones that have less than six carbon atoms and also a nitrogen or an oxygen atom. Um, so if we look at the first one on here, ibuprofen, first thing that we should be asking ourselves is how many carbon atoms are there? And if there are more than six carbon atoms, then the answer is no, it's not soluble in water. This molecule, we've already counted the carbons in this molecule, and it has definitely more than six carbon atoms in it. So no, that means that it is not soluble in water. Vitamin A. Again, first thing that we should be looking at is how many carbon atoms are there. And there's way more than six, so that makes it also not soluble in water. This is actually pretty simple, right? Look at THC. Are there more than six carbon atoms? There are quite a few more than six carbon atoms. So again, not soluble. For the rest of the molecules on here, we're not going to go over them. They are a little bit more complicated than just as simple as counting carbons. And if we were doing this in class, we would talk about them, but we're not in class, so we're just going to leave them off.